Hey everybody, welcome back to Poker Collection. I am back with my sister, Hello. Anya, who we're going to be doing another foodie collection episode today because our friends at Krispy Kreme have, um, have released the first ever Pokemon Donuts, official Pokemon Donuts that have been released across Australia and New Zealand. And so we've got what five different flavors so we've got pokeball flavor pikachu one we've got a uh, squirtle one a bulbasaur and charmander so the um i'm gonna read them out here because i can't remember them all we've got the pikachu one which is uh the signature original glazed filled with a choc creme dipped in white truffle and finished with a pikachu white choc plaque Sounds really, really I sweet. That's going to be really exciting. Um, and then the Pokeball one, uh, which is also the glazed, which is dipped in white icing with red sprinkles, finished with a Pokeball white chalk plaque. I'll go with this one. Ah, oh, the next one is a, our signature shell donut filled with um, creamy cu ooh, custard, dipped in white truffle, finished with a Charmander white chalk plaque. Sounds good. And then we've got the Bulbasaur one, uh, which is our, uh, the iconic original glazed donut, again, dipped in green apple icing. Oh, that's dope! Yeah, finished with sand sugar uh, and a creme swirl and a Bulbasaur white chop plaque as well. And then the final one is Squirtle. Oh, it's strawberry, strawberry oh, flavor. That's, an int that's weird. <laughs> You'd think they'd probably use that for like a Charmander or something, or yeah. a Pokemon one. Um, but the last one is Squirtle, which is a strawberry flavored filling dipped in white truffle finished with a squirtle white chop plaque we've got them right here nice and fresh we've got them today and it's got this really cool quirky um little flip um flappy bit there which is pretty cool it's not it's kind of nice to have that kind of on display like mm. i actually i asked them for a box and they didn't have any spare i really just wanted the box because i love branding i have weakness for that anyways let's open this up and as soon as i open it up you can just smell the that awesomeness. sweetness it's oh, it smells so good um, so I'm gonna try and fold this over. Right, there we go. So you guys will have um, seen our partnership with Krispy Kreme a long time ago. This is not sponsored, I got this myself. Um, but we're a huge fan of their glazed donuts. Um, we do he seem to hit a sweet limit when it comes to their filled donuts, but I'm looking forward to trying mm. these ones. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna sort of sample each one. I'll give you guys a quick look at what they look like in full, then we're gonna cut them, um, and then uh, we're gonna try them and review them as we go. Um, and so that's gonna be the video today. So um, shall we start with the Pokemon? Yeah, because that, one, that one's the less, uh, like, got less on it in, in it, yeah. so I think we should start with that one. So let's do this. Um, I apologise if I, uh, if I, if my hands look really messy after that this. That Pokeball looks crisp. It looks really good. It looks dope. It looks really nice, and it's really soft and light. And that's mm. the that's the underneath of that. So that's the glazed <laughs> glazed donut. So this is just a glazed donut, and then then it's got a <laughs> white chocolate piece uh, on top. So I guess we're gonna so we just cut that up here mm. off camera. Um, oh gosh, that that was that's that was quite easy. Such a sh like proper good cut. <laughs> Do you want to try that? Yeah. Okay, cool. Right, so I'm gonna try the chocolate, the white chocolate bit. Damn. Hmm. Yeah, good. Mm, tastes like white chocolate. Just white chocolate. <laughs> Watch out. And so the donut and glaze, let's try that. Mmm. Mm. So good. That's so good. It's like... If you like the glazed, it's like a glazed plus. It's got like extra icing and that crunchy sprinkle with the, with the sort of white, um, white chocolate finish. Mm, it's pretty nice. good white. Yeah. Uh, okay, right, so which one do you want to go next? I'm thinking... Should we try um, I don't want to do Bulbasaur one yet. Not no. Bulbasaur? Okay. Um, Bulbasaur, I, see, I think Bulbasaur seems to be the most out there one. Yeah, let's do that last. Five. Yeah. Um, okay, let's do um, Charmander. Charmander, okay, cool. So Charmander is the filled with creamy custard, it's dipped in white truffle, mm -hmm. and it's got a Charmander white chocolate bit there. So let's give you guys a closer look here. Um, very orange. Again, very light. These the, feel the really light. The plaques look so, um, plaques, whatever. Um, they look so crisp, but I love the way they've done it. Yeah, it's like sort of solidified, like, like, yeah, it's just really nice, eh? Mm. Really cool there. So let's open it up. Did I give them a look at the Pokemon? cross? I didn't give them a, sorry, I forgot to give you guys a, did I cross give you section. a cross section view? Um, that's the cross section view of the first one. I'll make sure we we'll do a habit of that. Keep tabs on that. Yep. Okay, we're gonna cut the. We're gonna cut this. I wish I give you, could give you. Oh dear! Oh wow! <laughs> that just oozed out there. So let me give you guys a closer look. Oh god! 
it's like a disaster's happened here. But you can see the nice um, custard in there. The Choc Charmander. Um, and, and the, the Choc Charmander has just sort of gone inside. But it's got this really nice, um, really nice um, custard. custody bit there, which looks really Can't good. Can't go wrong with a custard donut. Yeah. So do you want to, should we break one apart? Yeah. Wait, is it? Our fingers are going to get so messy. That's okay. I'm just going to take a bite. Let's have a... Itakimasu. Yeah, nice. Mm. So if people don't want to sort of go for any sort of flavoured, like super out there flavours, this one's really good because it's just like a custard. The icing's changed though with these two. Yeah, but it's in, a, in a good way or? Mm. No, it's nice yeah. and nice and smooth. Yeah, um, it's, 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 it's like your custard filling and it's got the icing, gives you that extra sweet hit on the top. Mm. Um, so I guess those ones are really good ones to start out, sort of start out with. That's a good one. Uh, you can't beat simplicity though, I have to say. Okay, I'm going to choose Pikachu. I think next. Mm. So I think Pikachu is just another glazed one. Uh, oh no! No, no. Chocolate. It's actually got a choc cream in there as well. And it's got the white truffle as well, plus the white chocolate plaque as well. Can we use well. my plate to cut it now? Um, yeah, sure. Maybe I'm running out of space here. Yeah. Um, okay, cool. So we've got the, the, the Pikachu one, which looks really cool. Um, you wouldn't think that there's anything in here. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> well, actually, now I do. <laughs> It's like they've been really injected, the, <laughs> really, really injected the chocolate here, which is uh, looking delicious. So let's check that out. It's a ring donut. A ring donut. The other yeah. one wasn't. Let's wipe the knife as well, so we don't cross contaminate. You know. Yeah. It's really hard to do like 3D collection videos. Oh, that was a good. That was a good cut. Oh. Oh. Uh, well, oh. I'll take that one. Okay. Right. So let's have a look inside this one. Oh, this one looks good. So we've got the we've got the glazed, um, nice and glazed. And then we've got bits of chocolate in there. Yeah. Sort of seems a little bit... I don't think it's like in the ring. They have to kind of do it in bits of the ring. Mm -hmm. So do you want to have it cut up to pieces? Let's check that out. Nailed it. it. Might work in case that stops recording the video. Oh gosh, yeah. Okay, right. Eat like a mass. Mm. That's actually not bad. Mm. It's very nutty. Yeah, the chocolate's got this sort of nice nutty. There's a slight moussey texture to this this choc. I thought it was gonna be like Nutella or something. No, it's, well, it's not hazelnut, mm. but it's got this really nice, um, yeah, earthy nuttiness to it, which is quite cool, without being hazelnutty. And it's kind of moussey as well, which is quite very very. It's definitely sweet, but it's uh, definitely got that sort of um, what do you call it? It adds to that. Like, it's quite, you know, double downs on the sweetness quite a bit. Mm. Right, next one, we've got Squirtle. two more. We've got Squirtle. I want to do Bulbasaur last. Bulbasaur last, yeah. I think Bulbasaur, Bulbasaur is the most... different. Yeah, I remember last time I, I worked with Krispy Kreme, they had the Rick and Morty ones, and those are funky flavours, and they were interesting as well. These ones are a little bit more safer, I think, because they're catered towards more kids. Um, so they're not sort of, like, super out there. Mm. Um, so this one's got the strawberry-flavoured fa filling. Um, and it's again dipped in white truffle, uh, so that's going to be just a nice little jam. Let's jam. Oh, Ooh, that looks good. That, actually, I like the contrast in that color as well. Oh gosh, it almost fell. <laughs> um, that looks, that's a nice. Um, I've squished it, obviously. They're so because it's so. Um, oh god, it looks like <laughs> a. I'm just going to quickly move it to the behind the scenes footage of how yeah, like, it looks that. like um, a real bad Situation. accident <laughs> has happened here <laughs> um, yeah so um, I squished it's so fresh that these donuts like squish so it looks like it's not generous but there's actually quite a lot of um, jam in there so mm. let's uh, let's try this one All right mm, this looks good oh wow the jam's nice mm. yeah, usually good. it's too sweet but it's nice you know that's a really nice jam. I normally I like don't. That. I don't. I normally don't like jam because. I don't, um, yeah, that's weird. I actually think this is my favorite so far. Yeah, that's really good. That's really good. That's really nice. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Right. Last one. Oh god, how are we gonna do that now? I have no idea. I'm gonna get some tissue. Right. Last one is. Um, we've got the glazed donut, and it's been dipped in green apple icing with a sand sugar on it and a cream swirl. No, I got this. Don't worry. Oh, you can just. We can just. We can do it. Ooh, this one's sort of like, like a bit more. This sort of this is set really like a bit harder. It's like a shell. It's quite a nice shell. I guess shell. it's because, oh well, you think more of it for Squirtle because Squirtle has a shell. 
Yeah. Oh yeah, that could be cool. Right, so we're gonna cut this in half. That's definitely cross contamination this time. <laughs> but, well, well, that's okay. We can, yeah. we can we can deal with that. Right. There's nothing in it. There's nothing in it. So because it's, it's just a glaze, but I'll give you guys a closer look at the green, the cream swirl. Sorry, I can't hold it because it's all slipping. It's all falling as well. Um, so we've got the cream swirl, which looks really inviting. I love I love a good cream. I love cream. I don't know if you guys love it's cream. Good. But anyway, okay, last one. Um, let's check this just out. Dip it in the cream. Yeah. Get all the flavor. Let's just get that whole. Let's get the whole thing in there. Good job. Oh, that's nice. Hmm. Okay. Now, I just want to say this Krispy Kreme donuts for me are usually really, really sweet. And yeah. This is actually. This is alright for me. And by the way, we're not sponsored, so we're not, you know, we, we can say what we want. And even if we are sponsored, we'll say what we want. Um, but it, it's but sweet, but it's not that sweet. It's tolerable. Mm. Like, so, like, this this apple, so you've got this um, very subtle apple. It's not overwhelmingly apple, so if people don't like fruity flavours, it's very, very subtle. It's nice. And also it's nicely balanced with the... The really fluffiness of this cream, they really nail that cream. I think it sort of feels like you're sort of eating a cloud. Mm. Almost like marshmallow mixed with candy floss. It's got that sort of weird texture mix. Mm, I don't know. What not that... chewy though, not chewy. It's just very light and the airy. The cream has that, yeah. The cream. Yeah. Whereas the green shell is more like, you know, definitely your more apple flavour. Mm. Um, but I, I reckon, I think Squirtle. they're all... I think they're all good. I think they're all good. Yeah. But I, I don't, my, your favourite one's Squirtle? I think it is, yeah, which is weird because I don't like jam donuts, so that I was think, my favourite. I reckon my favourite one is going to have to be... Oh, I'm tossing up between the Pokeball because I do like a glaze and I love simplicity and I do like... I like the added crunch and icing on there, so I like that. I think, um, yeah, I'm going to go with the Pokeball. I think I like that because it's just, it's like my favourite plus... That's like elevated with with a with a crunch <laughs> as well. Um, but I think yeah, if I was to rank them, I think my least favorite would probably be. The um, offense. I don't know. Not, I did. The, the, I don't know the texture for the chocolate. Was I'm, a bit off I'm, I'm tossing between Pikachu or Green Apple, but but they're both good. Or or actually Charmander. I think Charmander because custard the custom one really doesn't really add I too much. I completely forgot that we had a custom one. Yeah, yeah. So the Charmander was custom one. So I don't really know. I think my favorite in my okay my, my ranking would be Pokeball. Followed by Squirtle, mm -hmm. followed by um, I think Green Apple, mm -hmm. then Pikachu, and then Charmander. Okay, mine is Squirtle, Pokeball, um, uh, Bulbasaur. Um, sorry, don't not look at me and pressure me. Uh, Charmander, <laughs> and then the Pikachu one. I don't know, the chocolate didn't do it for me personally. Well, that's pretty cool. I think that's quite nice. Mm. Thank you, Krispy Kreme, for bringing that, um, bringing this to us. Um, if you guys uh, have bought this already, if you're in Australia, New Zealand, I'm not sure if um, it's actually going to be available overseas. But if you have in Australia, New Zealand, let me know which ones you got, and if you tried them, any of them, uh, let us know in the comments below which one you, is your favourite, or if you haven't got a chance to try them, what you would love to try the most. Uh, leave us a comment in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe, and if you guys want to see more foodie updates and reviews. Um, follow my Instagram, otherwise just uh, keep in touch and uh, yeah, let us know what you want to see next. Take care and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. Yeah.